Hi everyone, Sherwood Small Pets here and I'm here with Robin Hood and Little John and as promised I'm going to do a video of first impressions from their new Piggy Pop Shop items. So currently we've got Robin Hood and his very favorite snuggle thing ever which was also the very first one we ever got. It's a pig one by Piggy Pig Pigs. It's amazing. And then we've got Little John who's just in the lap pad and it's actually from Dollarama. So it's quite large. It's a dog bed actually but we loves it, don't we? He's like, what are you doing? Stop playing with my toes. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go get this, their new snuggle items. So it's definitely worth noting that my boys are usually, see they're going into the old one, but it's usually worth noting that more often than not, oh fine, go put me wrong, I have to put them in the new snuggle items before they'll actually go in them themselves because it's all about smells for them and if something doesn't smell familiar then they're not going to use it. Hi baby! You're just going to go back into the pig wom? Of course! I'll probably have to take the pig wom away just to take the familiar option but if they don't go in them by themselves and stay in them, are you, you've already peed. Hold on. The boys decided to uh, pee, and it's a good thing that I washed everything yesterday. I washed them twice, which is generally how much I need to wash them to get them to start wicking. Um, so it's a good thing I did that. However, you know, not the greatest thing to look at for uh, video purposes. Hi, baby. It's like, no. So, okay, so, so far they figured out the tent, which I knew was going to be the first thing, just because my boys, it's not, it's the same design idea as the pigwom, which is why I got it. <laughs> You're not going that way, you turkey! And little John has a tendency, because he is the younger one, he will go basically wherever Robin Hood goes. So let's, I'm curious to see if they can even figure out the hoodie hut without any kind of help, because it took them a long time to figure out cuddle cups, so we'll see. No! Oh. So apparently they both want a tent. Sniff where the pee was, because that'll give you all your answers. And when all else fails, return to Pigwom. So of course you'll see these in their new, uh, when we do their new cage tour setup, which will hopefully be done by the weekend. Uh, we are waiting for just a couple other things to make it. This won't be the full out, um, we're doing a, uh, whatchamacallit, oh my goodness, nautical theme, which is hence the whale, but that'll be built throughout the summer, so it should be done by, like, July. Um, so the ne like they're for their July cage tour, not their June one. I'm sorry, I missed a, I totally missed the May one because I think I did my first introduction of their big cage for Courtney's Cavi's uh, contest, which is, so I didn't want to be like obnoxious with a cage tour. But anyways, so it appears I'm very surprised that Little John's staying in the tent. He's usually the last person or person last guinea pig to try a new thing. So, oh, and by the way, for those of you who have been asking about Gus, I've almost got enough footage for a video. He does not like that kind of thing, as I've said, so I've been literally working on one video since about February. So... Robin Hood? You feeling displaced? Okay, so I put Robin Hood in the cuddle cup, or in the hoodie hat, just to see, so he could start, he sheds like you wouldn't believe, whereas Little John really doesn't shed, so um, I put him in there and hopefully he'll get his smell all around because boys are all about making their smell known to everyone. That way they'll be more comfortable with it and then they'll figure it out. Right, baby? See, Robin Hood's my snuggle butt. Got hay by your eye. There you go. He's my snuggle butt. He'd stay out of his cage all day if you let him. Because he's just happy all the time, aren't you? He's also very tolerant. He takes my sister's constant, like, annoyances like a champion, don't you? Also some exciting news, since I am graduating from um, Teachers College, well, it's actually concurrent education, but it's basically Teachers College, it just took me five years um, to do with my other degree, I will be getting a new camera. So, yay higher quality videos and a... Um, what's a tripod so that'll be fun 
something to look forward to. Hopefully it doesn't change my voice too much. Um, what else? I figure I might as well give you updates while we're trying out the new flea stuff. Oh, is he going to show his face? Hi, baby. <laughs> I am so excited about these items. As always, Piggy Pop Shop is just brilliant. Uh, everything she do everything she does... Um, everything she does is flawless. And we have no complaints. They love their... Um, the, you'll be seeing they got a new cuddle cup from... Well, not new. It, they got a secondhand cuddle cup that's Piggy Pop Shop. Uh, we picked it up from a lovely lady uh, named Ta Natasha and we got some our first cage liners from her as well so that'll be in the in the cage tour so many updates right boys okay so I think that's about all we have to say today uh, we will be back uh, with within the next couple days or so with a cage tour and hopefully Gus's video will be up at some point next week so that's we got lots of stuff going on around here I'm now doing two tutoring gigs so that's good, so I can, you know, spoil these guys a little more. And if you liked what you saw and you want to see more, please remember to like, subscribe, and share. Take care, everyone. Bye. Oh, and my super pretty dog couldn't resist saying hello. So, hi, Matt. Hey. Yeah, say hi, Internet. He hates cameras, so this is going to have to go away. Yep.